Seven men came into my house with guns. I admire what Charlotte is doing. If she was not that strong, the case would have gone off right now. People give up. He shoved the gun inside me and said, if you scream, I'll shoot you from here. One of the detectives said to me that no one wins rape cases here in Kenya. The only advice that I was given was to leave the country. That's not fair. The anger in me had started to stir then, so I was like, I am not walking away from this thing. It was the first time that we had a rape victim talking about the ordeal mm. in an open court. He undid his zip and he just kept coming at me while the other man was raping me. The first story you told them is that you are also sexually uh, abused. They were like, is it true that also a white person can be raped? I understand what that feels like, and that's why I talk to groups of women such as yourselves. No, no, I say no to rape. It took me that incident to understand my own strengths. They do that every day. Yes. Have Asante. confidence. You win this case, man. There's a file, it's been taken, so they're tampering with the evidence again. Oh my goodness, now I'm holding my files uh, so high. Mr. Ondieki, for the accused persons, is not in court, and there's no explanation for his absence. Will you proceed without him? This is ridiculous. What I want her to do is hear this thing, and I want her to do it today. She's about to give me a date in November. That is how they move the court off here. Tomorrow, 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 and you keep tired till you go. This system is so wrong. Women don't want to go through this. They've just been through this trauma incident. Why traumatise themselves again through a court? That is all. Oof, that is something that you don't have control over. I can't do this anymore. I try to stay strong for a bit and affects everything in my life. Pain is a temporary thing, but regret is going to last a lifetime. I've never fought for anything in my life like this.